Arches National Park in Utah is now at the center of a $270 million lawsuit. It's all over the death of a woman from Denver that attorneys say could have been prevented with an $8 padlock. Ludovich Michaud wanted to take his new wife to one of his favorite places back in June. But on that trip, she was decapitated when a metal gate at a parking lot swung into their car. Esther Nakajigo came to America after becoming a woman's rights champion at a young age in her native Uganda. She received several international awards for her work, including Uganda's Young Personality of the Year. Nakajigo had been studying at the Watson Institute in Boulder and met her husband last year. The couple got married in March. Investigators say surveillance video caught what happened and that there was only a second to react when a gust of wind blew the gate into their car. A lawsuit filed last month says a cheap padlock could have prevented the death of an influential woman who was destined for greatness.